My name is Dr. Sandra Gracia Jones, and I am the Vanessa Wertheim Endowed Chair in Chronic Disease Prevention and Care. Well, my mother said that ever since I was a little kid, and I was the oldest daughter of seven, um, I was always taking care of my brothers and sisters, and she said I was a little nurse. Um, and as a teenager, I was very aware of the respect that nurses had um, and our community really had a lot of respect for nurses, so I was very excited to pursue a career of nursing. I'm originally from Massachusetts. Uh, I came to Florida many years ago on spring break. I actually interviewed for a job while we were here in spring break. So after I finished my bachelor's degree in nursing, I came here. Met my husband on Miami Beach, um, got married a year later, and I've been here ever since. And I realized that although I had a great nursing degree, I wasn't as aware of adult education learning principles. So I went to FIU and got my master's degree in adult education there. And then many years later, I was very happy after I finished my PhD to be able to take a job at FIU College of Nursing, which then became the Nicole Wartheim College of Nursing and Health Sciences. And also my teaching uh, focuses on HIV prevention working with our nursing students and uh, teaching them how to talk about HIV prevention, how to talk about sexual health to other students, and then having them go out and teach a curriculum I developed on HIV prevention to other students. We then expanded that program where we actually had the nursing students go out and teach the freshman students at FIU during orientation classes. and very good results where we saw with our freshman students HIV knowledge increased and also their intent and interest in getting an HIV test. By working particularly with communities of color and working with Hispanic female population, I hope to change the rates of HIV infection for that group. Um, but also looking at HPV and realizing that African Americans are disproportionately affected by HPV, if we can also increase getting our young college students to get vaccinated, that's going to change the outcomes in cancer mortality rate in the future if we can intervene now.